good y'all welcome back to the channel man What's good y'all welcome back to the channel man y'all know who it is it's your boy Dante man Yo, I got some rude people on my phone. Let me just silence this thing. Yo, I've been on social media. I've been on Twitter. I've been on Facebook. I've been everywhere. And all I see is this Popeye's chicken sandwich. So I decided, you know what? Since it's buzzing like this, I might as well just go out and get the dang thing. I should stop being so lazy, get up and just get the sandwich. Right? Right. So without further ado, let's hit this Popeye's up, man. Let's see what this buzz is about. If y'all are new, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Turn on post notifications. This is easily one of the most lit channels on the face of this earth, bruh. And if you already here, you might as well like the video too, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Let's get straight to it, man. Here we go. All right, y'all. So, the closest Popeyes to my house right now is like eight miles away. Probably like 10, honestly. That's how you know this ain't the hood. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm about to blast some tunes, though. Your boy doesn't want to get any copyright strikes. So, I'm going to catch y'all when I hit this Popeyes, yo. Yo, this is crazy, dog. This line's wrapped around like twice. I have never seen anything like this. This sandwich better be good, yo. Yo, I've never seen anything like this. This is unlike anything I've ever seen. <laughs> For a sandwich, bruh. This better be the best sandwich I've ever had. Dog, is this the dude making the sandwiches? If this the case, bruh, this sandwich gonna make me swole. <laughs> I have never in my life seen a fast food line this long. Like, I've never seen a line wrap around twice. And I know Chick-fil-A like at lunch hour and stuff, that's a different story, but bro, y'all should honestly see it right now. Like they are hauling in this chicken. It's not even funny. Dude got swole off this stuff, I can already tell. They got two people like, it's a huge truck that they got all these boxes taking it out from, man. It's they were working over here. This is probably the hardest Popeye's workers have probably ever had to work. Dang, man. One eternity later. So I'm passing the front right now. I wish I could show you guys this. Like, even inside is packed. People that are just walking in are walking out right now. So I can only imagine what this means. Let me call them and see what this means. They're so busy, they're probably not even gonna answer. I'm gonna be real. They ain't answering. All right, I see a guy walking in right now. If he comes back out, that means that they don't have these sandwiches, bro. Look at that line, man. I wish that y'all could see this. I wish that y'all could see this. This line is like wrapped around twice. All for a sandwich, yo. Y'all really think I'm joking about what I'm about to tell y'all. That Popeyes ran out of chicken. <laughs> that Popeyes literally ran out of chicken, man. All jokes aside, everybody that was walking inside that restaurant walked right back out. And I asked somebody, what's going on? This lady and her kid, the kid's crying, the baby that she's holding and her daughter, they're upset. What happened? They ran out of chicken. They're not gonna have any till later. Inside there was just packed with people. Packed. So after days worth of waiting and waiting and waiting, after Popeye was running out of chicken for their sandwiches and crying babies, finally, the moment is here. You wanna tell them about your experience? So the Popeyes I went to is in like the city of my church, which is a very like isolated-ish city with lots of old people. It's really country, man. Um, Extreme. But the store opened at 10.30. I got there, I think at like noon, maybe a little before noon. Um, and when I pulled up, 
literally the line was already like a wrapped around the building and like pulling like rolling out into the street y'all saw how wrapped around that line was that i showed you guys before it was basically the same thing except on a sunday morning which is kind of absurd um i witnessed so many people trying to like cut into the line i was this, on facetime oh when it happened this it was one pickup truck like there's two entrances into the to the restaurant and so everyone was using this the main entrance to get into the line so because the line was wrapped around this <laughs> other guy used the other entrance on the other side and just cut in front of like 10 no joke 10 cars and like two cars ahead of me this woman was like not not having it and so she just literally just blow, like, blows on her horn and starts yelling out the window at the man and the man just rolled his window up and kept it pushing um all for a chicken sandwich too so yeah i guess hopefully this is worth the hype is honestly. this what it comes in yeah that's i guess the, the presentation isn't necessarily the best but here we are chick-fil-a here it's a whole it's really just a whole white like lunch bag, bag y'all I feel like they ran out of bags too. They probably did. <laughs> Low key, like, like it was supposed to come in something that said Popeyes on it, right? Um, I will say when I was leaving, like the lady who like you know gave me food and took my money, she was like, "Did you see the craziness happening out here?" And I was like, "Yes." Their lobby was also closed. I think that's a regular. Yeah, I think so too. Because their air conditioning was broken. This actually been a little bad. It's a really big piece of chicken, though. I will say. No, this one's spicy. Yeah, definitely. Bad. You know what? I think I'm gonna try the spicy one first. I don't like spice. No, I, I love handle spicy spice stuff, well. man. Oh, this is real. This is what? This is literally. Please look at this piece of chicken. It's like just a big chicken tender. On <laughs> that a piece thing's of bread. huge, man. Like it's not even flat. Well, this reminds me of like a Zaxby's nibbler. <laughs> Oh my gosh. This is what the hype has been about, so. Let's do it. I might have to try this again, because this presentation wasn't the best. The bread's I just kinda think the bread, I think the presentation's not gonna get better. I don't think so either. Unless you maybe eat it in the store. Yeah, I'd have to agree with that. Like, that may be the only difference, because like, yeah, I feel like you have it in the store in the moment, you know? Well. Here we go. We'll see what the hype is about. I ain't even gonna lie. It's good, y'all. This tastes like chicken, cuz. This is some really good chicken. It's like, I mean, you've had Popeye's like chicken, right? It's been a while though, I ain't gonna lie to you. It literally tastes like their actual normal breaded chicken. Mm -hmm. But it's boneless and on bread. So I really don't see how you could go wrong. They could add some cheese. Or some lettuce. I could use some lettuce. This is a very big sandwich. Very. And a little bit of lettuce would be nice to break up what's going on. <laughs> what do you think? I, I'd buy it again. I'm going to buy it again. I, I'm insane. It's really good. It's dry. It's not that dry. I mean, maybe just because my chicken is literally like... Like, my chicken, I think, is stupid thick. Like, it really is. I think that's the thing. I think that's my favorite part about this so far. The size? I like the sauce that they got on it, too. Whatever spicy sauce it is they have on it. The bread's not bad. It was a little hard. But. Loki. Loki looks stale? I don't know. Overall, it's not that bad, though. Wanna try it? You don't like spice for real. This is not spicy. Just bite it. Believe it or not, it's actually pretty spicy. Oh. This looks so good, oh, man. I ain't even gonna lie. It, it snuck up on you, didn't it? <clears throat> It's like a blue cheese and was like Yeah, they mean when they say spicy, believe them, yo. I don't like Chick-fil-A spicy chicken sandwich. I love it. That's my favorite from Chick-fil-A man. Thanks. Honestly, I think I'm gonna do a side by side comparison. Chicken sandwiches from Popeyes and chicken sandwiches from um Chick-fil-A. See which one's better. That's gonna I be really they're hard. very different. But low key they're the same. Like Okay. Um <laughs> like they are, but at the same time like this is actually really, I didn't even plan on finishing this. It's a different caliber of sandwich. How is that? Taste the other one. Can I just like take one more bite of this? It's right there. Take, take, whatever. Did you go at like a bad time of day or something? Like, this is really good. Morning. No, that's the thing. Like, I, mean, I was like 12. I mean, they only open for like an hour and a half. It's true. But how many breads and sandwiches do you think that's they had? a lot. They were busy, like they were busy, y'all. Yeah. Oh, this is probably the hardest Popeyes has ever had to work, like ever. That's so actually bad. really good. 
This is a humongous sandwich. Like, I don't know if I can actually finish this. I'm lucky coming back to this tomorrow. This is very good, though. Like, no cap. This, this is really good, man. In regards to chicken sandwiches, though, if I'm being 100% honest, Chick-fil-A met their match, man. If y'all haven't tried the sandwich yet, man, please try it. Please try it. All right, guys, that's it. That's our review, our take on the Popeye's chicken sandwich, man. <laughs> if I'm being totally honest with you guys, although that was a pretty, I don't even want to use the word bad, it wasn't the freshest batch of chicken sandwiches that they gave us. That was probably, <laughs> I'm not even lying when I tell you this, probably the best chicken sandwich I think I've ever had. You can't go wrong with Popeye's chicken sandwiches, man. I'll be real though. <laughs> the things that people are going through for this sandwich is pretty absurd. Like, some dude cut the line and they blew their horn at him. Man, y'all saw the line that I had. It was wrapped around twice. All that craziness. All this for a chicken sandwich. I know, it's pretty, pretty absurd. But once you get your hands on one, if you haven't already, you got to. But once you do, you're going to understand why people are going this crazy over it. I really do think though, I'm gonna do a side-by-side -side comparison with like Chick-fil-A and Popeye. I wanna see which one's better, I'm not even gonna lie. Cause I'm a huge Chick-fil-A fan too, man, but this Popeye's chicken sandwich is, it's, it's up there with the best chicken sandwiches, period. I mean, it's probably my favorite, if I'm being totally honest. Oh my gosh. I still can't believe that first day that I tried to get the sandwich, they ran out of meat for the sandwiches, yo. Cause I think all they had was like legs and thighs. That same Popeyes that I went to, I was on Facebook and I made a post about this. My friend was saying that they ran out of bread, but he put it on like biscuits, he said, so he enjoyed it. <laughs> but anyway guys, that's it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed our review and our reaction to it, man. Literally, it's one of the best, if not the best chicken sandwich I've had personally. But let me know if you guys want to see any other eating videos, any mukbangs, y'all want to see that Chick-fil-A comparison. I really do need to try the mac and cheese too, actually. But y'all just comment your ideas, man. Subscribe if you're new. Go ahead and give the video a thumbs up, guys. Comment any ideas that y'all have, man. I love you guys. I'll catch y'all in a bit. Peace.